Life's a big circle jerk, you know that? Everyone's standing around. <clears throat> Everyone's sitting around just jerking people off to get the jobs, to get their money. I mean, look at how the financial system's set up. You, you got a big pile of money. You set it up in a fund. And you, you collect interest off it. You're out doing anything. Just, here, here's my money. Give me interest. Don't, don't you think that's a stupid way of making money? You just put a whole bunch, like, it, just like the the house market. You, you take your money, you put a whole bunch of money on a house, and then you rent it out. Making money off it. It's, it's stupid. It's school. You know, you invest in school. If you go to a shitty school, you get shitty jobs. And it's not even true because most of the time you won't even find a job if you go to a shitty college. Let's say you go to Phoenix, Arizona. Like versus a, a Phoenix, Arizona student and a Harvey student. Like, you know, who's going to get the job? The Harvey student. Because he spent bukus of money on his college. Like, it's always about your name, you know? It's always about your, your, uh, your, uh, your reputation, reputation, your reputation. It's always about your reputation. It's like, what the hell, you know? Like, I just want a job, you know? Like, right now, like, because I'm on welfare, if I try to go find a job, and because I've had because my credit's terrible, I'm not going to find a job. You know, it's like, I got to do a circle jerk in order to get a job. So I got to find somebody that's willing to stick their neck out for me and give me a job. Which, this was fine when I was younger. I had people just line up for me to give me a job. But once I got older and got crazy, people were like, ah, I'm not doing a damn thing for you. Shit. I have people that don't even want to talk to me anymore. <clears throat> it's like, oh, you know, you don't want you don't want my hand anymore on your on your cock circle jerking you. That's what life is. Life is life is just a big old circle jerk. That's what I'm saying, like, it's all about who's in your circle. It's not about who you know, but how you know. Them. I mean, this is general information that I, I tell my kids. I'm like. You're going to a crappy ass school. You're going to a public school. It's bullshit. The only way you're going to make it is if you're rapping, playing basketball, or playing football. Or you become an actor. There's the only three, four things that you could do to get out of the. out of being, uh. uh. being poor. Unless you become a business person, but. Yeah, good luck with that these days, because you got to do a whole bunch of circle jerking. The only way you're doing that is if you got everything lined up for you right. Like you went to one of those prep schools and border schools and got around all those other rich people. It was like, oh, oh, that's, that, that person's all right, you know? Yeah. Hey, my dad's got a firm. You can come work for him or something like that, you know? I mean, have you seen Wolf of Wall Street? Did you see the things he had to do in order to make it rich? He had to steal, lie, cheat, drugs, everything. And you know what he did? He got a circle jerk. He made a circle jerk around him. That's what created his business. He circle jerked everyone around him, gave him lines, and it made him rich. So that's what you got to do. You got to find your own group, circle jerk them, into helping you make a lot of money. That's what every business does. You find people, you circle jerk them, you make money. It just every every single thing. 
even your family. Your family, you circle jerk them into making you, into giving you money. So life is just a circle jerk. That's my take on circle jerk. Everything's a big old pyramid scheme. Everything from family to friends to everything, you know. And if you on top, everyone want to take you down to their level. And I'm at the bottom, and I want to take the top to my level of common sense. But, you know, common sense don't win when you got lies. Because lies just deteriorate common sense. You know, why can't it be where, you know, if you you got money, you have to go into the the principle of your money. You know, or whatever the hell the name they call it. You go into your money. You spend your money, you know. You can't get interest in things. That's for the poor. Why, why can't it be like that? The poor can put up their money and make money. But you have to live off your interest. Off your money. You can't make interest off it. Once you a certain amount of money. Why can't it be like that? And then we wouldn't have all this corruption that we have. Why ain't nobody think of this? Maybe someone has. But I think if you got billions of dollars. I, I think there should be a cap. On uh, anything over a billion. There should be a cap. And uh, anything over one billion should be a hundred percent taxed. I think yeah, you can't make interest off money if you got a certain amount of money. You have to live off the money because I think it's welfare. I mean, everyone cares about me being on welfare. These rich people are on welfare all day long. Look at it. you just put up. Big money, amount of money on something, make interest off it. You, know, you got 150 million, put it on this, make 350,000 a year, a uh, month. What kind of bullshit is that? It's called financial bullshit. Yeah, what about families that own banks? You know? <clears throat> You know, they keep saying that there's risk involved, but there's no risk if you have the system rigged. Because you know when it's going to fall and when it's going to rise. So it's just a big old circle jerk of pyramid schemes and shit. You know when it's going to fall. You know when it's going to rise. You know it. You know this shit. You know this shit. This is a bunch of bullshit. You know. Life's a big circle jerk. And they don't fucking tell you that they're circle jerking you until you get out of school and you're like, oh my god, what the hell is all this? Then you go to college and all that kind of crap. Then you you fucking, you do everything right, and you get a job and shit, and then you look down at everyone else for not doing what they're supposed to be doing, which is a bunch of baloney shit anyway. All you do is working for someone, making them richer. And yet you look down on me because I'm not working. Bunch of bullshit. Work to make somebody richer. That's the middle class. I work to make someone else richer. And you're like, you're happy about it. You're like, yes, I made this person millions of dollars. Even business people are like, 
are making millions of dollars for someone else. I got my little cut today. Oh, look at me. I'm awesome. And you want to create anything new, it's just. It seems like everyone that creates something new actually just stole it. The real creator never really made any money off it. I mean, look at Facebook. It was stolen. This guy's got billions and billions and billions of dollars. A thief. Look at Microsoft. Same thing. He stole it from somebody. He didn't create it, but he's got billions of dollars. I mean, it's a well-known fact. Bill Gates didn't make his shit. So that's what happens. The rich just steal the stuff to make yourself richer. You, you can go to the cabbage bat doll. The cabbage bat doll. It was stolen. Someone else took it. Made a whole bunch of money. The person that originally made it didn't get a damn thing. So capitalism is just stealing other people's ideas. If you got a certain amount of money, you could just pay off anybody that's got it and make a lot of money off it. Buy low, make money. It's a bunch of bullshit. Hey, you know that artist got that hit song? Hey, I'll pay him a million dollars and I'll make a couple billion off him. And he's just prancing around all happy and shit. Like, oh my god, I got a billion dollars. Oh. I'm on the radio. Woo. Look at all the people jealous of me. It's like you dumb shit. <laughs> you're poor still. That's why you're writing cars and <laughs> and writing guns and prop guns and you didn't even pay for any of that shit. It was just your label. You'd be just like ludicrous living in a little shitty house. So well, I made it. I made it. I'm part of the one percent, the very low one percent. Sorry, you wasn't evil enough. You didn't make enough money. Well, all right then. This is EJ. Sign out. Damn.